Easy FM is an FM radio station servicing a local market, so we want to add local time calls between 6am and 6pm. This is just one of the features that can be achieved through the use of Station Playlist's Break Notes function. First the tedious part, but you only have to do this once. Record a time call for each minute of each hour between 6am and 6pm and save them. We'll create a folder called Time to do this. Now you can of course just buy a package of time calls already pre-recorded, either from Station Playlist or other suppliers. But we want our radio station to sound local, so we're going to do them ourselves. Once all the time calls are recorded, we'll go back to the Hour 1 rotation, select the point where we want to add our first time call, click on Insert Break Note, and a whole list of available break notes will come up. We're interested in the second one, Time Announcement. So put a tick in the box and click OK. We'll see the new entry with an asterisk time on it. We'll learn more about break notes when we move on to the Playout software Station Playlist Studio. But for the moment we'll add two more time break notes to our rotation hour one and then do the same to hour two with time calls in different places. What more can we do to create the local sound we're after? How about adding an announcer between 6am and 10am weekdays with more than just standard song intros and outros. Now you could always do this live manually when you put the program to air, but there's a quicker way using automation called voice tracking. Let's go back to our hour one rotation. Right click and copy it and call the new rotation morning one. Delete the first intro, then click on insert VT marker. Creator will ask for a duration, but we can leave it at zero and click OK. The rotation will now show a voice track. Do the same to replace the outro after the next country A track, and again for the intro leading into the last one for the hour. Click OK. Then do the same for the hour 2 rotation. We now have three voice tracks in each of those hours. Go back to Schedules. Copy the daily schedule and call the new one Weekends, and restrict it to Saturday and Sunday. You'll be asked to confirm that you want to remove those days from your daily schedule. So click Yes to All, open the daily schedule, and replace the 6am and 8am rotations with Morning 1, and the 7am and 9am rotations with Morning 2. Click OK to save it. Our daily schedule now has music, station IDs, intros and outros, time calls, and in addition, our weekday schedule also has voice tracks between 6am and 10am. You can also create schedules for particular times of the year like Christmas and use the Advanced tab on the Schedules page to automatically replace your regular schedule with the special ones on a particular range of dates. Let's create a new playlist. As before, click on Create, then Start. When it's completed, click on View Edit Playlist and navigate to 6am. There you'll find the first of our time call break notes and three voice tracks, which have a line through them to denote that they haven't been recorded yet. So let's do that now. You can either record them one at a time or all together. Let's record the first one by itself. Highlight it and then click on Record. Our record application opens up ready to record. This time it shows the outgoing track before the voice and the incoming track after it. The options are the same as when we recorded the song intros and outros. You can choose to select Automatic again, but this time we'll select Manual Outgoing Incoming. You'll notice the next arrow now shows Start Outgoing. Click this or use the shortcut key to start and you'll hear the last few seconds of that song. When you're ready to start talking, Click the arrow again which is now reading Start Recording and Start Talking. You'll hear your voice over the outgoing song. When you're ready to start the next song, click the arrow again which is now reading Start Incoming and you'll hear the start of the next song. When you've finished your introduction, click Stop Recording. Then Save and Exit. You can then move on to the next voice track. Work like this until you've voice tracked the entire schedule. Our dialog will then show Complete and Close returns us to the Playlist Editor. Click Save and close the Playlist Creation box. Close the Playlist Editor and click on Save All to complete the updating of the playlist.